All right, folks, Rocky Drake here, Rocky Drake Outdoors, and today I'm going to try to catch some bait. And I'm going to go through the process of what I look for in catching uh, yellowtail, threadfin shad, or gizzard shad, and, and where to kind of look for it. So we're going to start right here around these barges. Basically, that's what we're going to do today, and if we have time to fish a little bit later, we may even go try to catch a fish. So sometimes it's hard catching bait, and sometimes it ain't. And here lately, it's been a little bit tough. This Garmin right here, it's got live scope on it. And what that'll do, that'll show me the minnow way out in front of me before I ever get to them. We're gonna go over here around these barges and snoop around and see if we can find any bait, any threadfin shad or gizzard shad, either one today will work for me. Uh, we're gonna, a lot of times when they fill these barges up, they'll spill feed over in the water and, and the bait fish come up and, and feed around on it. So. I usually check these areas like this first. This net I'm throwing, it's a seven foot net. See that thing taller than I am. Looks like a lot of bait right here. See it down there on the bottom? Y'all see that? A lot of bait just right here. Right here in front of this barge. There we go. We just might catch some on this one. Looks like a lot of it down there. They filling this big barge up with a some kind of grain. Looks like corn. Oh, look here, y'all. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Oh, yeah, look here. That's what we're talking about right here. Look at that. Oh, there's a good looking gizzard. Mm-hmm. It's not no place we might catch some big logs out here in a little bit. Put them in there. There's one. Go at the back, he's a little too big. I'm gonna put that in there too. Uh, watch that net go down right through the middle of all that back right there. Look at that. It's, oh, it's loading up. You can see them right there. See that? Oh, I can fill them in there. Mm hmm. It's always a good feeling when you feel your bait in there. Oh, look at here. Well, we don't have to go, look at you. That's what we're talking about right there. See that? That's exactly what we want. This is all we're going to need to go fishing with. Uh, I'm going to put them in this bucket and sort them out. Put them in that bag tank. We out of here. We're going to fish it. He's talking about a perfect size bait. Catch fish on that head right there. I know a place. Just like, you know, you hear these guys. I know a guy who knows a guy. I know a place. I know, I know a place. Well, we can go catch up, I think. Be Look at them skies, y'all. See how them skies? That's what they call marriage tails right there. When they see them skies like that, the big fish are back. I got that, I got that uh, split shot's up about, I don't know, 24 inches above that, that hook there. Uh, I'm telling you, folks, <laughs> we can catch a really big fish right here. Let's throw right out there and just let her go down. Mm-hmm. Wait on one to snatch it up. That's what I'm talking about. I got a sneaky hunch we're gonna catch a big fish right here. This big, I don't know why. This is a post spawn. Uh, there he is right there. Oh yeah, Lordy mercy. I don't know what this is, but oh, he just jumped. Okay, come here. <laughs> Good fish right here. I mean, the first throw down there with him, with that. Oh yeah, that's what I'm. Look right here. Look right here. Oh. First throw. Be right here is what we caught him on. See that right there. Uh-huh. Yep. Well, folks, <laughs> what y'all think about that? Yeah. Oh, first throw right here. Just got here. Just caught the bait over yonder. Come back right here. We've been catching nothing, too. Yeah, sometimes they stack up big time in one little area the big fish do. Might not catch nothing but big ones right here. Oh, Lord, how much. I'm just giving it line. Let me go down, down in there. Well, that didn't waste no time grabbing it. Maybe the only one on here too, I don't know. We we'll can find out. There he is, there's another big one. Oh yeah. <laughs> Uh, oh my gosh, this is another big one, y'all. It's another big one. Oh yeah, look here, what a big fish. 
this second throw lane. Just caught this and you get that little hook out of it, man. I tell you. <laughs> oh, ain't no ten how many's in there, boy. Ain't no <laughs> Go back down in there. Ooh, he shook it off. Did you see him shake it out? Mm -hmm. I can't wait to get another get. We like to catch one right here, weigh 10 pounds. Showing up. I gotta get in there. I'm telling you folks. Stream bait tank, look at it. Stream bait tank is what you want. Let's get us another. That makes two. Two throws, two bass. Two good ones too. Let's throw back down in there. Oh, boy, oh boy, he can be up in there. Mm-hmm. We'll throw right over there now. Get down in there and catch me a few. I'm all tore up. I said I'm all tore up. Mm -hmm. I'm just letting it go down to the bottom. Those bigger fish are going to be laying down there close to the bottom. Sometimes they're right up against it. Sometimes they're out here close to the boat. So I don't get too close with the boat. Get on top of them and just poke them. There's one right there. I got him. <laughs> He's a big one too. Oh my gosh, this might be the biggest one. <laughs> oh, oh, he broke my line. Oh my gosh. He broke me off, y'all. Oh, that's a big fish right there now. I'm telling you it was. I should check my line. I didn't check my line again. I got too excited. We can tie another hook on, but we think they they right here. I'm telling you right now, they mm. That was a flat-footed big one right there. It just broke my line. Broke it right off at the hook. See, it don't take long to tie that pole here. Look at y'all. Uh -huh. uh, okay, here we go. Oh, that's a big man. I ain't gonna throw one down there yet. Mm. All right, I'm gonna go back there and do it again. Uh, all right, I'm getting serious about it now. I ain't playing around. We made three throws and we've had a hold of three big fish or three fish. That was a flat footed big one. Maybe I'll catch and find a hook in the mouth. I know what he is. Maybe. Anytime you got several fish together like this, they're a lot more aggressive on the bite because they're competing for that minnow down there. There's one I already got it. It's gonna be a big one here. See him swimming out here with it? Here we go. Oh yeah, this is a big one. Oh yeah. Yeah, get over here. Oh yeah, it's a big one here. He's a big one. He pulling. Feels like a good one anyway. Oh what we got here, y'all. Oh, now he's seen the boat. He's, it's a good fish. Really good. Oh, my goodness. It's bass. I think it is. Oh, yeah. Big one. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yes. Oh, big one. Big one. It looks like a big spotted bass. If it is, it's a horse of a spot, y'all. Oh, my goodness. Look, look here. What a fish, y'all. Oh, it is a big spot. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh, big spot I've caught in a while. I want y'all to look at what a big old spotted bass. Uh-huh. If we can turn it loose now, we think been catching nothing. Oh, wow. Oh, there she went. Back up on you. I'm telling you, turned into an epic afternoon of fishing. Oh, Lord. I'm ready to do it again. Catch one with a mouth about that bigger. That's what we want. Bucket mine. These fish are post-spawned right now. They done spawned out, most of them. And they move back out in this river channel. These big fish, when they bite it, their mouths are so big they suck that minnow in, and you never, you, you don't hardly feel the bite. All you do is you see your line swimming toward the boat, and you'll feel weight on it, and you set the hook and hold on. Just check. Uh oh. I think I just felt one run up there and sniff of it. I don't know for sure. I'm using this ducket rod right here. See his ducket rod? Uh huh. It's one of them silver rod O's. It's one of the cheaper ones. But hey, I'm good with it. It's medium. Look at it. There's what it did right there. See, beat him. All right, I got a little weight in there. I may have one on here. I think one's got it. Oh, yeah, one's got it. There he is. Oh, yeah. Not be. This there ain't playing around. Oh, another big spotted bass. Oh, my gosh. The big spots are in here, boy. It makes a second big one. I done caught. Well, I ain't caught him yet. I gotta, gotta get him up here. Be working with them. Yep. Come in. All right. I got you. Now. Look at there. Another big, pretty spotted bass. He ain't big as I thought he was. But he's a nice one. I'm going to turn him loose now. Uh -huh. What pretty fish, y'all. Yeah, you go back down in there. Make a second good. Now, he ain't nowhere close to that first one I caught on. Far size wise. Uh -uh. 
these big fish, they just swim all around out in here, really. They're coming up out of that river channel. I think when they come, when they postpone, they come up that river, and when they get in here, they'll come up here and feed a little bit and go back out and go wherever they go, but you just gotta catch them up here at the right time. I hadn't been here in about two months. Look at y'all. <laughs> payday. I'm gonna say, we got a payday going today. We're getting paid for all hard work. We put in catching them. Mm -hmm. Bye -bye. Love this live bait fishing boy. We'll tell you what, a good afternoon. Folks, we'll see you next time. Yes, we will.